The central nervous system is referred to as the body's central authority because it combines information from the entire body and coordinates activity across the whole organism. Functioning as a hub for all functions in the ecosystem. The blockchain industry has been plagued by segregation, isolated systems operating independent of each other. Just like the central nervous system does for the human ecosystem, the Nervos Network is aiming to become the central hub for linking and synchronizing all activity across the blockchain industry. The Nervos Network is an open source layer one public blockchain ecosystem with a collection of layer two protocols efficiently operating on top of this common knowledge base layer. Acting as the central nervous system for the blockchain industry, it is setting out to connect all blockchains together in one synchronized ecosystem where developers and users have complete access to a revolutionary new technology like we have never seen before. Nervos is a network of scalable and interoperable blockchains built on top of an open layer one no network called the Common Knowledge Base or CKB. CKB is built as a security anchor for all blockchains in the Nervos network providing a trusted and secure settlement layer so that projects can store their data off chain and free up congestion on their own chains. Through a duly layered architecture, Nervo strives to become a bridge between all blockchains, integrating a secured public common knowledge base as a layer one and a host of high performance application chains called layer two or multi-chain solutions. The project aims to make blockchains accessible to enterprises and end users seeking to work from a single hub and have instant access to the entire industry of blockchain projects. This common knowledge base or CKB will act as a knowledge database offering universal, universal interoperability across every chain where any project can store immutable data and access this settlement layer from mobile applications and the internet. This will allow other blockchains to free up valuable space on their networks where they can focus on speed and throughput. The CKB Layer 1 blockchain provides essential security through a neutral, decentralized, and open public infrastructure, while Layer 2 networks and protocols enjoy unlimited speed and flexibility. These Layer 2 networks run on top of the common knowledge base, the secure, permissionless, and decentralized Layer 1. Nervos has several Layer 2 solutions integrated with the common knowledge base layer. However, it is also available to every other project that integrates with Nervos. So far, Ethereum, Cardano, EOS are the three main external integrations on the CKB with a goal to encompass the entire industry. Tokenomics the primary issuance at layer 1 is 33.6 billion CKB, having every four years, with the first having expected November 2023. This model is similar to Bitcoin and has a hard cap supply. Secondary issuance. An annual secondary issuance is held constant at 1.344 billion CKB and is divided three ways. One, as compensation for miners, state rent on all external projects storing data on the CKB chain. Two, as compensation for Nervos DAO depositors, users that have locked CKB in the DAO, who earn staking rewards and are protected from inflationary effects from the secondary issuance. And three, treasury funds, which will only be accessed when the primary issuance reaches its end after all halvings have been completed. Today, secondary issuance is being directed towards miners and DAO depositors, while the CKB that would be deposited into the treasury fund is being burned. The treasury fund can be activated in the future through a community agreed hard fork following depletion of the Nervos Foundation Ecosystem Fund after all halvings have run their course. Through CKB can be used to pay transaction fees. Its primary utility 
is a claim on storage space on chain. Each byte or CK byte is a claim of space in this database. One of the important features of Nervos Tech Tokenomics is the allowance of freemium payment models. With them, DAP developers will be able to pay the network fees for their customers. This supports ease of use, greater retail and enterprise adoption. This subscription model removes the pain of many single payments and makes the user experience much more enjoyable. No need for entering wallet addresses or worrying about managing several different wallets depending on the token you are trading. With such a feature, the DAP developers can accept any crypto or even fiat from their customers, so the end users may not even know that they are using a DAP running on a blockchain. The CKB token will also be used to make payments for network resources and to perform actions on the network. When CKBs are being used by external projects to store data, they cannot be used to earn secondary issu issuance rewards through the Nervos DAO. So any project using the Nervos network to store data cannot earn CKB in the DAO. This is their way of paying for that memory space they are using. So projects are not charged like they are on other platforms like Storch, Filecoin, or Arweave. This makes the secondary issuance a function like a state rent or state storage occupation. This economic model imposes state storage fees proportional to both the space and time of occupation, which is far different from the pay once, occupy forever models used by chains like Ethereum. CKB holders who have their tokens staked in the DAO continue to reap the benefits of Nervos Network's growth and adoption. Other notable characteristics of Nervos Network are Nervos is focused on network mobility, supporting dApps and other projects that are able to run on mobile devices and integrate with mobile platforms. Nervos is focused on parallelism, which is which the team believes is the key to overcoming scalability challenges, allowing independent transactions that are processed in parallel, such as on different CPU cores or transactions sent across different shards. Nervos combines Nakamoto consensus and traditional BFT consensus. This allows its system to retain openness and availability and takes advantage of the performance of traditional BFT consensus. The Nervos team has years working in the crypto space. The co-founder and the chief architect of Nervos, Jan, has worked with Vitalik Buterin on sharding and Casper. He has contributed to the Ethereum network for several years. He and his friends and co-founders have built such crypto software projects as PDO Exchange, Spark Pool, the world's largest ETH mining pool, and IM Token, the world's largest Ethereum wallet. Also, they worked on a software development podcast called thour.fm, started CryptoTape, and created a permissioned blockchain called CITA, C-I-T-A, Nervos Programming Language. Developers can use any language they would like to create applications on Nervos. However, Rust was used for smart contract functionality because it was preferred among developers. Interoperability Comparison Nervos is incredibly interoperable by comparison. Compared to Polkadot, Cosmos, Binance, and Near protocol, Nervos Network is the only network capable of access from mobile applications and the inter internet. Nervos is fully interoperable with other projects. Only Binance offers one bridge to ETH but does not allow cross-chain bridges with any other project. Nervos is almost fully multi-chain virtual machine, v compatible, VM compatible. All others have very limited capabilities. Nervos has been engineered to conform to industry standards such as the RSCV virtual machine, ensuring that a broad base of familiar tooling is available to developers.
minor rewards. Nervos Network CKB Layer 1 is very similar to Bitcoin. There is a halving every four years and miners are compensated with both block rewards and transaction fees. For block rewards, when a miner mines a block, they would receive the block's full base issuance reward and a portion of secondary issuance. When Nervos mining rewards eventually end, miners will still receive state rent income that's independent of transactions. Here is where Nervos tokenomics gets interesting. Base ish- issuance of CK Byte refers to the total number of tokens that will ever be mined on the Nervos network. Of the total 33.6 billion CK Bytes, miners would mine a total of 16.8 billion tokens in the first four years, nothing more. In the following four years, the total mining rewards would automatically be reduced to 8.4 billion CK Bytes and so on. This process will follow until zero issuance is received. Nervos DAO Nervos CKB includes a special smart contract called the Nervous DAO. Users deposit their holdings into the DAO and receive a portion of the network secondary issuance, the base issuance being the block rewards for proof-of-work miners. Using the CKB token to store data on the CKB creates an opportunity cost to all CK by owners or stakers in the DAO. The Nexus DAO Nexus DAO is a decentralized autonomous organization that runs a mortgage-based stablecoin system running on the Nervos network. It is called the Nexus Protocol. Users can use the Nexus governance method to approve assets as collateral to generate stable currency. And the agreement can also solve the problem of poor liquidity of CKB mortgage after Nervos DAO through DCKB. At present, Nexus DAO has officially opened its internal beta from now to September 3rd and participating partners will also have the opportunity to obtain a limited amount of NFTs. Muta Muta is a versatile high-performance blockchain framework designed to make blockchains easier and more flexible. Blockchain developers can quickly create their own blockchain based on Muta, getting rid of the tedious work of building a core network and consensus mechanism from scratch and focusing on business functionality. Muta is an important division of Nervos Network. It uses CKB as the value and security anchor to extend user scenarios and scalability. For example, the Nervos Foundation is cooperating with Hubai Group to build Hubai Chain to explore regulation-friendly decentralized financial services, which is based on the Muta framework. Muta will play a pioneering role in the mass adoption of the Nervos network. StarFi With recent announcements in the Nervos network surrounding non-fungible tokens, or NFTs, StarFi is a Web3-based multi-chain chain multi-channel network for NFT creators looking to transform the scope of minting and buying of NFTs. Their NFT ecosystem brings together content creators and prospective buyers in a unique, mutually beneficial manner. The integration of StarFi with Nervos will allow NFT creators to mint NFTs on the Nervos network blockchain, thereby avoiding large gas fees and saving on network congestion time while fully benefiting from Ethereum network's effects. By leveraging the Nervos network, StarFi users can mint NFTs and circulate them between different EVM-compatible blockchains. It will also allow for the sending and receiving of NFTs with no fees at all, zero fees, as the NFTs created on Nervos network are self-packaged. Like Nervos, StarFi is committed to a multi-chain future. They currently support Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, Polygon, Solana, and Matic. They will utilize Nervos' interoperability protocol to exchange assets with Ethereum and other blockchains. By utilizing Nervos Network's tools and features, StarFi users will have an intuitive and friction-free experience. It can eliminate the need for complex mnemonics or seed phrases and makes it easy for those who are new to the crypto space to send and receive NFTs. NERBOT. The NERBOT is a Telegram NFT marketplace bot for the Nervos Network blockchain. The 
the NERBOT team has been in contact with on-chain analysis for a unique opportunity for on-chainians to ask questions and learn more about NERBOT and what it plans to deliver for NFTs on the Nervos network. Nervos has a growing community base that has increased significantly in recent months. This channel will continue to support the development and flow of information to the Nervos community. Nervos has additional community resources that can be found on their website, including an active Telegram, Discord, Reddit, and Medium accounts. Nervos is poised to disrupt the entire blockchain industry, and the CKB token is one of the most held coins by hedge fund investors worldwide. There is a high amount of potential in this project, and the team has been working hard to make that future a reality. More recently, Cardano, IOHK, a parent company of Cardano, has partnered with Nervos to improve the security of smart contracts. Both companies intend to expand their cooperation in stages, with the first phase of the partnership being uh, the launch of joint research in the field of UTXO registries and smart contracts. A dedicated team will be tasked with developing an improved framework for other UTXO-based blockchains to create a scalable and more secure alternative to Ethereum checking account model. If you are interested in learning more about Nervos or joining its thriving community, hit the subscribe button and stay up to date on announcements and ecosystem developments. That concludes today's review of the Nervos Network. Please let us know if you have any questions you would like answered specifically. Thanks for joining and safe investing.